I mean, there are so many different influences that impact the behaviors of these young men. So I wouldn't want to just lean to one particular aspect. However, fatherlessness is also a component of that. You know, um, I, I, we spoke about it, you know, the void that is left, um, the hurt, the pain, um, the the absence of uh, uh, that male figure being able to, um, I guess, I guess, teach that child, you know, the emotional co connection and emotional components of men, how men, how men interact with people, how they interact with the relationships, how they build relationships, how they deal with conflict. In terms of challenging that, it starts in terms of our socialization experiences. So to start to rethinking how we try to teach men to be men and recognizing that men are sensitive and they have feelings and that we want to help men to be able to connect with that part of themselves and to also be able to sort of connect with just other people as well too. But it's also at the policy level as well too. So we have particular policies, for example, where we give women opportunities for things like maternity leave, where, where there are provisions specifically in place for women with regards to caregiving and child care. We also need to make policy changes that include men in terms of that process as well.